just wanted to give you a quick video again. And today I'll be building a sort of trap, sort of thing, a monster trap. And basically what happens is, is the monster walks over a pressure plate, and which will activate some TNT. Then the TNT will drop, and the monster will drop as well, into the hole and explode, basically. <laughs> and let's get started. So basically we're going to dig down 10 blocks. That's one, two, three, four, five. Right, I think that's ten blocks, and then we're gonna make a little room for the trap to be in. Okay, now that you've got a five by five hole and three up, and basically we're going to make this shape. And that's the hole we dug a second ago. And then we're going to make that there. And now we're, we're going to need some water. This is like, this is unlimited water which I got using a program called IMV Edit. And I said that before and I've said it a number of times. And um, if you could just use a bucket of water that's uh, easy enough, it works the same way, so and we're going to put water in that hole, then put blocks there, so now the monster will be trapped. And we could, um, we could put a block there as well if we wanted to, why not? And now we're going to put in some torches to make them trim nice, and then we're going to take a hole for us to get into. There we go. Now we've got this hole and that hole. Basically what we're going to want to do is take some TNT and put it there and then a pressure uh, pressure plate. Now what happens uh, when the monster sets off the pressure plate is it will drop down there and explode. And I'll show you what it looks like uh, for a monster to drop in. Yes, just over here, zombie. Just over here. Dead. Loot. Okay, as you can see, the zombie will, or the monster will drop down and die, and now you can loot all the now you can loot all the drops, basically. Um, I've tried various ways of making it so that the the water will flow out, and then you can get the drops like over here instead of having to take away this block. But it didn't really work very well, and the monster didn't actually die from the explosion once I did that. I'm not really sure why, but it doesn't matter because this is fine to be honest. So. I hope you enjoyed that tutorial and I'll see you later.